Hey guys, it's that random dude, and today I'll be showing you how to install Paintown on your Android device. So, um, this will work on pretty much any Android device that you have. So this, this will even work on like Kindles if you're using that. And yeah, so basically, what Paintown is, is essentially um, Muja imported to Android. So, yeah, um, and it also doubles up as a beat em up. So, yeah, pretty cool, right? So, so yeah, so you'll need to go to this website right here, paintown.org, and you want to go to download section right here, and you'll need to go to paintownrelease.apk. Now, um, you will need to like allow unknown sources for this, so make sure you keep that in mind. Um, it is completely a safe download, by the way. So yeah, so after you download it, you just wanna install it and it should and it should appear and it should appear as so right here pain town so you want to click it and here we are so uh, this is um so yeah this is the menu here I don't know how to change up the um the screen resolution yet but yes yeah, so you've got all these game modes here just like regular menu game got your options um, I'm just gonna start to play gameplay, just so you guys can see like how the game is. So I think it's running off Win New Gen, I think. So, kind of an old version of New Gen, but yeah. So you can do your special moves, you can basically do what you want here. Yeah. Um, and of course, you can add your own characters in stages and stuff, so. Yeah, I can't like more music. But I highly recommend the use of um, an external controller because the controls on it are not too good. So, yeah. Um, so I'll be showing you how to put in your own characters. So, um, you want to go to Z. I recommend using Z Archive for this. So here is a paint town. And you want to go to the Mugen section, characters, and here. I have an extra character here, Ayatan Amiji Taka, don't know who that is. And you simply just want to pop them into this folder. Or you can just pop them into the select.def into your text file and just add the characters there. Uh, you can also add your stages, I think, in the same way. So yeah, go have the def and sff file. And yeah, um, but also I'm not sure if you can add in screen packs. So yeah, you can also add in your music as well. So yeah, and there's also the beat em up aspect of the game, but I am don't really know much about that. So that is how you get, so that is how you get Mugen on your Android. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Bye.